Longines Global Champions Tour, Doha Leg 14, staging the grand finale for the second year in a row in the magnificent Al Shakab. Qatar, one of the world's most dynamic countries, couldn't offer a better scenario to bring forward the 2014 LGC champion in this unpredictable and stunning season in its ninth edition. An all-star cast of the world's best brought together at this crucial part of the season the decisive meeting of the Formula One of international show jumping, while only one of the three superstars competing could be crowned as the new king of the Millionaire Series. In fact, the last Grand Prix of this series saw a dramatic battle between Luc Gebirbaum, Rolf Jorovinks and Scott Brash, all arriving in Qatar ready to rewrite the history books. Mastermind Uliano Vezzani set a very tough first round, which delivered the small number of eight clears, including the first pretender to the throne, Rolf Joran Benson, amongst them, and Scott Brash on one time fault alongside Constant Van Passion and Bassem Hassan Mohammed of Qatar. Anyway, all the eight pairs qualifying for the second round together, all with riders on five faults joining them, and the two best combinations finishing on eight. Luca Birbaum, who chose to ride Zinedine instead of Chiara, was out of the game straight after his round in round one. In the second round, Iceman Scott Brash went through with a clear, putting on the pressure on Rolf, who in the meantime produced the best result he could, qualifying for the final three to go forward to the jump-off, even if he knew already the overall LGC title was going into the Scotsman's hands. The decisive part of the competition started with a fast and furious clear of Luciana Denith and the stunning Fit for Fun. Canadian Jan Kandel on board his amazing showgirl were fast enough to beat Luciana's time, but they finished on four faults. Rolf Jordan Benson and the incredible Casal Ask, last to go in, produced one of the most beautiful performances ever seen and caught a fantastic, well-deserved win in the LGCT Grand Prix of Doha. In the end, Lugu was overtaken by only one point by Scott and by Rolf, who both achieved 243 points. But on account back of the best wins of the season, Scott having three of them, the golden boy of the season was crowned the champion, and the Scottish rider, for the second time in a row, took the trophy. Britannia rules again. And in the meantime, we'll see you in 2015 with a new sensational Longines Global Champions Tour series.